basically tried to gangbang her at the same time. It's black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. Yo, welcome back to another installment of this strange thing I do on the internet. If you're a newer viewer and you want to know the vibe, please go subscribe, click the bell to get notified, and check out the clothing line. Okay. So today we have my favorite preparation of hot dogs. I made them all the same. This is my kind of, I guess, little invention to myself. It's called the Canadiana dog. And what it is is hot dog, regular, well, all beef. That's what I like. I like all beef. That's what I prefer uh, with ketchup and mayo and bacon and onions. This has real, uh, like, cooked actual bacon sometimes i put like the shaky ones that are made of soy like the bacon but uh, today we're going full real bacon so before we do anything more we must pour coming in hot with the diet pepsi that's what we've got to work with today we don't have any of our other usual flavors but that's fine One of these days soon, we will get back to regular programming, and ooh, we had a spill. I don't like that. Not my favorite. Not loving the spill, but oh well. Okay, let's have a sip. Not bad, not bad, not bad. All right. I'm uh, very excited to get into these. I am starving and I am certainly ready for them. And like I said, it's my favorite preparation of a hot dog. I just love these flavors together. They are so magical in my mouth. And I do believe if you were to try them yourself, you would say just the same. As long as you like everything that's on the dogs. All right, without wasting any more time, we go in. look for you up close and personal mm -hmm. amazing I put the buns in the air fryer for a quick little toast up so they got you know, they're a little bit soft, but they also have a little bit of crisp to them. This bacon is... Hitting on a different level. And yes, I do have a real paper towel today. I am slacking on my rag duties for the channel. I have not washed a batch. Little insiders uh, club information for you. Uh, I successfully made it 25 days now without eating any bread, pasta, pizza, any sort of like doughy, starchy type carbs. And I've been uh, low carb or keto all of those 25 days, as well as I have not drank any alcohol. So today I was actually going to make lettuce wrap hot dogs. Uh, kind of like the Big Mac style ones that you've seen me. If, you, if you're not new to my channel, you've seen me do these Big Mac style hot dogs but in the past, but with bacon. I was going to do that today, and I just... I said screw it. I got these buns. They were sitting in the freezer. I was like, I got to use these up, and it's been enough days. I, I'm having a, a dirty cheat, so here it is. Oh...
definitely a worthy meal to cheat on though. I like hot dogs are easily one of my favorites. And then during the eating of the hot dogs like this, you, I, I realize I'm eating pig on top of pig, just cooked in a different form. Or well, maybe not because beef hot dog. Common sense. Never mind. It's wild though how much bacon complements hot dogs. I already know there's going to be comments from people being like, You should have cheese on there, or you should have like a cheese and bacon dog, but unpopular opinion. I don't love cheese on hot dogs in general. Not a fan of like a bacon cheese dog, not really a fan of like chili cheese dogs. I don't know why. I just think the cheese is Rather unnecessary. Give you another little close up look ski here. Mm. So, so good. Speaking of dogs, I took my sister's dog to the dog park today. <clears throat> and two dogs basically tried to gangbang her at the same time. but they kept coming back and launching attacks. <clears throat> so I had to shoo them off. And I felt really bad for her, like my, like my sister's dog. And then, you know, you tell she was like nervous and uncomfortable and wasn't enjoying it. And these little buggers were persistent. And like the note, the owners were nowhere to be found really. Like they weren't you know, whistling at them or saying, hey, like, you know, stop it or anything like that. They were just way off in the distance just doing their thing. Which begs the question, not that I want to do it, because I don't. I don't want to get physical with your dog, but at what point are my, you know, little nudges for the dogs to get away permissed 
to become a little more, you know, stern. You know what I mean? At what point am I able to show a little force to these rowdy dogs fucking with my dogs and you're not taking ownership or, you know, taking control or watching over your dog? Quite the question. You know, not that I would, would want to have to do it, but hey, if a dog starts attacking my dog or, you know, is acting up, is acting up, you might get a little boot in the chest. Just saying. And then <clears throat> I'm sure as soon as you do that, that's when the owner would pipe up. Hey, what are you doing? Mm, controlling your animal like you should be, but you're not. This is also a bit of a last hurrah because I've been so low carb, so disciplined. This meal is happening now. And then I'm going on, I bought a juicer. I'm gonna go on a seven day juice fast. Green juices, mainly celery. So this was my one big final before I do that. So just a heads up for you, for about a week's time, channel's probably gonna suck. I might do some other style videos while I drink a green juice. And show you, I don't know, talk about some shit or show you guys some shit. I have some ideas. I know that the the videos won't be very popular, and that's fine. It doesn't matter. I've made peace with it. January sucks to begin with, and then. Also, just I need I want to go on this seven day cleanse for the benefits that I'm looking for. So I've surrendered and made peace with it. And uh, you know the ride or dies will come through for uh, these random other weird videos. So. We'll see, play around with those, see what happens. But uh, but yeah, that was that, certainly delicious. I highly encourage you to try this combination of flavors on your hot, next hot dog. Um, till the next one, you know what to do. Eat good, live well, and stay true.